Hello, and welcome to a Friday edition of Robert vs. the New York Times Crossword. It's currently 9.59 p.m. on Thursday, September 23rd in New York City, meaning one minute until the Friday crosswords. Yesterday, I in fact came in first yet again. Then we had Murr Unicorn in 16 seconds taking second, a tie between Rudwick, Stickers, and the Glorp, Aerotangos, Mar X, and Bill Boris, Pandaguchi, and Cape God at 30 seconds or under. Then we had Justin, Hoopla, Panda Doggy, Lydian, Kefa Sventa, Namgo, Lil Sun, Joe Obi, Andrew, M Heat 17, and Taro Tuna, ERL, and Nomad all dipping under one minute. Then we had Kimball, J Wu, Ball Don't Lie, ABC 104, and the Duke Priest. All right, well, it's 10 o'clock in New York City, meaning we should have some Friday crosswords. So here is your spoiler alert for the Friday mini. If you would like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The mini is always free to play. All right, let's do it. App there asks, uh, plaid, pasta, chicken, and king. Ooh, I almost said rook, because that's a corner piece, but the K was better. App slack, ashi. Sit in and dang. Okay. Nice little 10 second mini. But now on to the main event. That's the Friday Daily Grid, which is by Stella Zawatow Zawastowski today. Um, here's your spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Daily Grid does require a New York Times game subscription. All right, without further ado, let's get into it. Let's not like question mark, name and nickname in Israeli really politics. Is it BB? BB Netanyahu? This could be interior. Component of many sandstone features in the Southwest. Lesson for an advanced language learner. Live on air, like on a sign, like many documentary film. River through Bohemia. Ooh. It might end in an emoji. Text. Black hairstyle with square shaped sections. Box something. Lesson for the subject is econ. Um, big ink purveyor. What genes do biologically pass on? Uh, I don't know about that. Medicare advantage by another name. Apparatus with harness and flippers. Get to eat order. Maybe list for survivalist. The singer Bork. Icelandic? Icelander? These are ERs or ORs, maybe? Component, right. Lustrous shell compound is this Naker, right? So it's not it's not what I have here. Yet to be processed. Crude, crude oil. Needs, maybe. Place for fast growth. Skateboarders wear. Valuable carriers. Or valuable carriers, probably. Green symbol on Rotten Tomatoes. That's like uh, a negative review, right? Successfully convince. No contest for one. It's a plea. Important calculation for a weightlifter. This is a splat, maybe? Galaxy array. Sliding blank. Sliding scale. Idioms. Whoops. Skateboarder's apparatus. Ramp, maybe. Armored cars, that is nice. Something rock. Kim Possible. It's a rail there instead of a ramp. Quadrennial bonus. Daily in Paris. Le Monde. It's not a good look. A leer. Give kudos to. Dance around. Question marks next for some beetles. Waiting for an assignment, maybe. Okay. Helmet here. In code. Um, part C. This is Epson and Scuba. Hotbed. That's nice. Some pub goers. Okay. Ooh, this could be apps, huh? Like a Samsung Galaxy and a tie into the mini. 
eloped with. I'm blank myself. I'm dating myself here. That's nice. This would be Hora. Um, ants and hail. Waiting for an assignment, maybe. Oh, idle. Inner feature a laser. Choice cut. The belay? Festive season could be Yule. Little drawing question mark. Group of pelicans. This is turtle more than a few. Multitude. Multiple. Well, there's a surprise. Pulling down. We have Pren Ing here, Sunday best, finest. Paid athletes with day jobs. Well lit question mark. Uh, aircraft with low drag. Not requiring much attention, say. Help on wheels. Sibilant sobriquet for summertime singer Sarah Vaughn. Wow. Some prairie leaders. Is it a mom's? This is a word that roughly translates as swagger. Is it mafia by any chance? It could be making there. This is a fire. Actor Claude of BJ and the Bear. Copter Cousins. Uh. Not requiring much attention, say. Hit from behind. Ooh, something Mediterraneo. Is this Spanish? Mar? Ambulance? That's nice. Hip. Blank over. Ounce sterling. R is two. I don't know what. Current the Rand, maybe it's South African Rand. Not just live in the present. Affair de coeur. Hmm. It's gonna be. Oh, imagine that. Oops. But this could be gyros like this. Not requiring much attention, say. Um, or gyres? Not sure. Ooh, the elb? What's not to like? Box braids? Bedrock? Red rock, probably. Bet noir. Wow. Narrated. And ERs is what that was. Successfully convinced. Sell. Leap day. I see. Load. Lads there. This should be pub. Find satisfaction, Slangly. Group of pelicans, the NBA. Affair de coeur amour. Rear ended. There we go. Um, B. Hmm. Not just live in the present. Something over. Pip. Okay. Monoplane? I don't know if I like mono, but be a seed. Hmm. Not just a plan. Semi pros. Get some. Oh, tug. I see. Someone draws you in with a tug. I don't know Sarah Vaughn. This could be finery instead though. That's probably better. Sassy. Um Minor? That was it. Hmm. Sorry about gyros there. Didn't know Claude Aikens. Yeah, like if you have a minor problem, it doesn't require that much attention, but it's sort of a slant clue. I like this clue. I just didn't know who Sarah Vaughn was. So that's my own fault. Um, yeah, some interesting, interesting stuff. The 
Fetch Noir. Is that kind of like a bugaboo? A person or thing that one particularly dislikes. Maybe I should Google bugaboo while we're here. An object of fear or alarm, so it's not quite the same thing. Something that you don't like is a bet noir, or I guess dark beast. I slander box braids. Don't know much in the way of hair terms, but box braids does sound familiar. And I can see what they look like now. There we go, box braids. And a nice, a nice X. Um, armored cars. Yeah, pretty nice longish stuff, I think. Leap day. Yeah, I thought, because you actually do draw a bath, right? So it could be tub, but someone draws you in, they could tuck you in. Even, uh, figuratively, I guess. Imagine that. Monoplane. Why does it have low drag? I guess compared to a biplane, it has lower drag. I see. Lowest drag of any wing configuration. I see. So as opposed to like a, a biplane. Like basically all planes these days are monoplanes, right? I was expecting something more interesting than monoplane for aircraft with low drag. It, it feels like they just read the, Wiki, the first page of the Wikipedia article. <laughs> I don't know. And this is a thing that people do sometimes. It's like the um, the tense here is ambiguous, right? Hit from behind, that could be present tense. It could also be past tense. I feel like this happens a lot. It makes it a, a little trickier. Yeah, that's uh, Benjamin Net Netanyahu. Classic European rivers in crosswords. Now part C. So, yeah. Yeah, nice clue on, on apps. So the Samsung Galaxy. Also, was app on the mini? Am I wrong with that? Hard for, it's hard for me to remember. Hard for me to remember. Yeah, pelicans there is uh, capitalize. I didn't I didn't realize this. I just had a thought as I was doing this. Claude Aikens. Do I know Claude Aikens? No. BJ and the Bear was on long before I was alive. Are there other famous Aikens? Scottish surname and yeah, so this is a person with a surname surname. Do I know any of these people? I don't. I guess Jordan Aikens is the one I'm most likely to know. He still plays. He's a tight end of the Texans, but... I don't know. I don't think any of the Aikens I saw there were definitely uber famous. Um, yeah, gyro. I think like a gyrocopter? Other thing? Auto gyro. It's filled with an I, right? So. Gyro helicopter. Let's go with that. Huh. How come it seems to. There's the auto gyro company that spells it with an I. It's kind of hard to find. Short for auto gyro. 
okay. It's also a wire payment. I don't know, it seems like this kind of gyro, at least on Wikipedia, it's kind of auto gyro. It's spelled with the Y generally, but yeah, but I don't know. Not sure, not sure. I did get it, so that was just, in some sense, that was just luck. It's always just luck. Yeah, it's a South African rand. Yeah, reasonable, reasonable Friday. It did have some pretty obscure stuff, but not overly, overly difficult. And the the longer stuff is pretty nice. Um, some nice moments in the cluing as well. So fun enough for a Friday. Felt slightly quick, I guess. And later for tomorrow, we've got stickers, Kefas Venta, and E. Errol. And on the old secret leaderboard, We've got Andrew Cowboy Hat Emoji in 17 seconds, quite fast, as well as Namgo in under 30 as well. Anyway, thanks for watching, thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing, and I will see you tomorrow, probably at 10, for some Saturday puzzles. See you then.